يوما كنت تعانق دمعة الفكر تناجي الله في صبر وترجو رحمة تسري فعاش القلب Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh brothers and sisters and dear friends hope you guys are doing well uh, obviously with this video we want to do a little experiment as you know through the media Islamophobia is on the rise attacks towards uh, sisters brothers who's walking out on the streets is on our high so obviously what we said was okay let's put this to the test and get a few sisters who's obviously observing the niqab um, as you guys know uh, the Islamic clothing so we thought let them go outside see what kind of reactions are we going to get are they going to get attacked are they going to get looks are people going to be kind how are people going to react to the uh, way they are and the way they're dressed. So obviously we did an experiment and um, let's go and see what really happens. Hi, excuse me. Do you have any uh, job vacancies? Do you have a CV on you? Not on me at the moment, no. Just come back. Okay. Me, and you have to find a manager and talk with her. Okay, thank you for your time. Thank you. Excuse me, do you know if they've got any vacancies at the moment? Um, not in this store, I don't think, but it's all done online. Oh, okay. So, best let's go online, I'll play the CV there. All right, thanks. Yeah. Um, do you know if you've got any job vacancies at the moment? For what, Kirk Geiger? Yeah. Yeah, I'm afraid not. Uh, but try, you know, the board upstairs? Because I think my manager has put a full time. Oh, position. okay. So if you want to check and if you have a CV, you can drop it with me and I can let her know. She just left now. I haven't got it on me, but I'll come back. Yeah, if you come back, uh, I think she put the job vacancy already. But if you come back, uh, we'll look at it and then give you a okay. call if anything. Okay, thank yeah? you. No problem. Yeah, um, have you got any job vacancies at the moment? Um, you have to check yeah, we have to go into HR, which is on the third yeah. floor. Oh, is that for all the, the That's shop, for every, yeah? All, yeah, it'll yeah, show you everything. all the... Like all the different vacancies everywhere has. Okay. So if you go to the third floor and just ask someone up there because it's sort of like hidden in the corner. Yeah, it's like so yeah. it's like oh, over that okay. side. Yeah. Do you think I'm just gonna ask? Do you think this will be a problem to work in? I, d I think they only because our like um, from what she you wears know the hijab as well. Our friend Cece. Yeah, she. Oh, I think she, I know her. Yeah, she, I think um, she wears that when she goes outside. But yeah, then yeah. she, you have to show your face, but you're allowed to wear your scarf. Oh, okay. But I don't think the whole thing. You're yeah, allowed to so wear. that I would have to compromise that yeah? yeah yeah okay I think they'd all they're like if they gave you an interview and stuff like they'd probably talk like they'd, say yeah, probably if you wore this in the interview how do you reckon it will go like um, or you it's better to take it off for the interview yeah or maybe like could you request um, a, wom a woman to do an interview oh, and maybe you maybe. Could take it off yeah. yeah basically when you go up there they've got one board which has like all of the um, concession, concession va vacancies yeah. and then one and then if you go into HR you can just hand in your CV if you weren't bothered about a concession just anywhere oh, because okay. they'd accept you for like handbags yeah and you could um, ask her about your yeah because um, she thing. knows yeah. about it yeah, yeah. yeah. all and right you could ask in hr as well they're really nice up there yeah, yeah. okay yeah. all right thank you What's for that right? excuse me 
Hi, do you have any um, job vacancies at the moment? Uh, yeah, I think we do have it. Okay, no. Right, uh, do we hand in our CV here? Yeah, or? that will be demo. Okay, not online? Sorry? Not online, you want a hard copy, yeah? Yeah. Okay, thank you for your help. So, um, if you go on to careers.holistic.com, mm -hmm. um, and this is the password, Sydney32, and you can apply online. Okay, thank you. Um, yeah, and then the interviews are on a Thursday, I think, um, from 4. Okay. Uh, so you can put whenever you're free to come in for an interview. Okay, is there a certain oh, dress code? Or? Sorry? Is there going to be a certain dress code? Uh, is this going to be accepted? So everything for religious uh, purposes is accepted. Okay, yeah. thank you very much. Okay, okay. So there you, you go. That's all right. Thanks. No, no, come, 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 come. Excuse me, madam. I I, we're, just, we're just doing an experiment. We're just wondering what happened. I didn't do anything. Okay, experiment? Yeah, what, what's happened? What Are you happen? for real? Yeah, what, what happened? I didn't do anything. I was walking up the stairs. No, we're just, we're just wondering. I'm 60 years of age. Is she for real? What did she, what did she do? What did she do? Excuse me, madam. She accused me of doing something. Okay. What happened just now? Okay, um, as you saw, we came down the stairs into the train station and I'm walking down and this lady's walking up and she kicks me in my leg. I ask her, why did you kick me? She said, I didn't kick you. I she felt it, it's my leg. Up. Yeah, she just denied it completely. My leg hurts and I couldn't do anything. <laughs> and I was like, but you did kick me. She goes, no, no, you're crazy. And I was like, okay, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Excuse me, can I ask you a question? No. Uh, do you know where McDonald's is? McDonald's? Yeah. I think you have Burger King, but not McDonald's near here. All right. Thank you for stopping. Thank you. Excuse me. Um, do you know where Embankment is? Where? Embankment. Embankment. Uh. There's a long way to walk, but that's you can, all right. You can okay. I think it's just down the road there, and then you get to uh, to Waterloo. Yeah. And then I think it's that direction there. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. No Do you guys know where Embankment is? So what sorry? Do you know where Embankment is? Uh, the Embankment Centre is down that way. This way. I assume. Yeah. That, the yeah that well. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay. When you're right. All right. Thank you. Excuse me. Would you be able to take a picture for us, please? Uh, Oh, on my phone? Yeah, yeah, I've got my camera on me. Okay. Right. You just press the, you know the middle button? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. Right. Um, with maybe the, the clock in the background. Yeah. yeah. Um, but can you take a picture? I'm sure just Thank you. Have it. Thank you. I'm gonna die. So <laughs> Thank you. How was that? Just check. Sorry, excuse me, um, can you tell me what Waterloo station is, please? Waterloo? Oh, yeah. Sorry, don't don't kick the thing. Okay, this way. So you go up here where South Bank is. Yeah. And then go down the side of it that way. Follow yeah. that side of the bridge. And then just keep going. Go oh, it's like, down there, yeah? Go like an arch road. Pretty much exactly that way. All right, thank you very much. No worries, good luck. Thank you. We're going to go back. Did you get lost? It's not our fault. No, no, uh, <laughs> thanks. Excuse me. Sorry to stop you. We're just doing like um, uh, an experiment. I just want to ask, like, what do you guys think of what I'm wearing? Like, why do I wear it kind of thing? Oh, I think you're nice and... Oh, that's nice. We're nice that. eyes. Thank you very much. You're very beautiful yourself. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I you always wonder what's underneath them. Are you wearing jeans or yeah, a dress? Uh, yeah, I'm wearing jeans. Yeah, yeah. Um, just normal clothes. I like fashion as well. I did fashion in college. Hey, Johnny, thanks. I'm not answering my phone.
Do you know how old I am? No. I'm 18. 18. So yeah, I don't have a husband. Um, my dad does not like it, so that's why I want to wear. Why do you want to? Because I want to. Why do you want to? Uh, for me, I lived a different life before. Uh, I had everything out, you know, everything out, and I found when I spoke to guys, the only thing, yes, yes, yeah, th that's all I'm getting. No respect, no one's listening to me, no one's engaging with my brain. I found like this, I have control over my own self. When you're speaking to me, when you judge me, it, oh, is she stupid, is she nice? You're listening to my words and my, to my brain, you're not judging me on how I physically. So for me, I found this, um, I, find, I find this like empowering, for me. Uh, our volunteers uh, approached you, I think they asked for the time or direction? They asked for the direction. Okay. How do you feel feel when, when you see like a Muslim woman? Do you feel threatened? Because like, obviously you know like, the media perception. Do you feel a bit worried like what are they up to? Or is it just you just see them as normal individuals? Uh, individual individuals. Yeah. We're tourists, we don't live in London. So. Yeah, we're, oh. we're from the West Country where you don't see an awful lot of Muslim yeah, 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 people yeah, yeah. at all. So okay. but no, don't feel threatened at all. Yeah, I just wanted to ask, um, what do you guys think about what I'm wearing? Like because of the news and whatever or what you know about going to different countries, what do you guys think about what we wear? Uh, I don't like it. You don't I, like it? No, I don't like it at all. Okay. I'm going to be a bit sorry. Yeah, no, no, I want sorry, you to be honest. Yeah, 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 no, I, I want, want that. Yeah, yeah, it's good yeah please, honest. yeah. I don't like it because I think women before us has had fought a lot for all our rights uh -huh. and this is going back to losing part of our rights. Okay. So that's what I think. Okay. Of course, I respect you as your choice. Yeah, yeah, thank to you. Where you yeah. from? Spain. Spain, okay. Spain. Uh, did you know the, for, I'm talking about women's rights and stuff like that, 1,400 years ago, you know we believe in the Prophet Muhammad? Yeah. Peace be upon him. At that time, people would like bury their daughters alive and stuff like that. So at that time, when people were doing that, he would walk down the street holding his daughter's yeah. hand. When she came into the room, he would get up and tell her to yeah, sit down right. here. And like the first university was for women and it was by Muslims in Morocco. Okay guys, uh, well, welcome back. And as you saw for yourself guys, to be honest, we was there obviously um, recording with our team and we witnessed these kind of stuff and how people were looking but in all in all and even though that attack that took place people looking really weird etc etc i think in totality britain is not as islamophobic as we think because yes we did get a few odd looks etc here and there but in total like i said before i think britain is really tolerant against muslims and i think it's those a few individual bigots who obviously as you know in every black every in every community there's black sheep so obviously i think i'm just going to leave that that note guys thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video share it spread the message especially with your non-muslim friends thanks for watching assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh